How will you feel? How will you think when your sisters and mothers have been paraded naked? Daughters of Manipur, the daughters of India are asking the question, where is PM Modi? Forget double engine, triple engine. If the double engine is going in reverse gear, which is even worse. We are at Jandar Mandir today where people from Manipur are protesting against the viral assault video where two women were seen stripped and then being paraded and sexually assaulted by a mob of men in Manipur in a broad daylight. Indian Express had also learned from one of the victims that the women were left to the mob by the police themselves. We here spoke to few of the Manipur women and let's see what they have to say. I haven't seen the video properly but I cried. I cried and cried the whole day and I said I must go and support. You know, as a human being, I want to support goodness. The video was so shameful. It is all over the world. European countries are fighting for us. But our government is sleeping on it. The sister, the daughter, the sons of Manipur are both brutally killed. And they are asking for for the PM. And they are sitting in Jantar Mantar for the past two and a half months. Where is the answer? Is just a viral video enough? Just to wake up the slumber of the PM? How was it that it took two months for it to come out and then the day after it comes out, then action is being taken? Not till then. When they filed an FIR, nothing was done. How is that? You can see and experience and know the agony we have went through that seven to nine days trying to prove our claim, sharing those videos and talks about the proof that is at the stereo that they have gone through such a room of space. How will you feel? How will you think when your sisters and mothers have been paraded naked, being touched so inhumanly in such a barbaric way? I know each one of you, when you saw that video, your heart must have sat. You have felt numb. There was no more words in my chest. You will have gone through the anxiety, you will have felt that touch, you will have felt that pain, you will have felt yes. the sorrow. India, India Prime Minister, he talked about Beti Bachao, Beti Parao. Where is the Beti right now? The daughter of Manipur is asking for a question. Can he answer the question? The issue should have been resolved a long ago. But the state government chose to remain silent and chose to remain communal. And the central government, the PM Modi, Narendra Modi, he chose to remain silent which is highly condemnable and people from everywhere were asking him to speak up about this thing but now he has the only word shameful of this incident he should be ashamed of making such remark here i am standing not just a woman or a lady or a girl here i stand as a cookie jaw daughters to stand for my sisters to stand for the mother of all this nation if this can happen in such a small state, remember it will happen in each and nook and corner of our country in the future. Yes! And you saw one video. Let me attest to this that we have more of proof. Two of my sister has been raped. And they were asked to be raped by their mother, the mothers of the perpetrators. They knocked, they closed the door and they raped and humiliated them. They feel so helpless. Forget double engine, triple engine. If the double engine is going in reverse gear, which is even worse. So if double engine goes in a good human, as a good human being, we will go forward. But here we are calling ourselves double engine, but all of us know, the country know, the world knows it's so shameful. The world knows what kind of India we are all living in. In times of the ethnic conflict, it is always um, the vulnerable women in the society and the poor laboring classes who bear the measure brunt of the clash. We are sad and in the agony every day. Most of us have not sleep, honestly. When we try to have our food, we cannot. When we try to sleep, we cannot. We wait for the morning to come. That's how much pains we have gone through. And today, as the wall stands for us, I want you to know that this happens. 
not because they were just the women. Let me tell you, it happened not because they were just the women or to satisfy their carnal desire. It was because they were a cookie jaw women. Please keep that in mind and attach to your heart and show that if they were a cookie jaw women. There are too many things to demand. Government is just out there to get vote and destroy humanity. You know, they are just out there to get vote, vote and nothing else care. They will step on anybody, they will do any damn thing just to get vote. But what is the point? You know, first you should be human being. How are you going to answer to the God, whichever God you believe in, how are you going to answer? If your intention is so so bad, if your intention is horrendous, absolutely shameless. We want a strict action to be taken upon those policemen who were present at that time. It was being reported that there were some uh, policemen at the spot and and it was also reported that the incident was uh, uh, taken up to the police, um, the police station, but they were not taken any action. And as I stand here once again, I want to request the government, the people, the people who are in power. We want justice as a democratic country. We adhere to equality, justice, prosperity, and peace. We seek peace. They seek peace. They want equality. We want equality. But for that, grant us separate administration. Because when you grant us justice with separate administration, I believe equality and peace will surely follow. Because justice is always the precondition for peace. We shall live in peace. We shall live in peace someday.